Hi, I'm Apostle McDonald Ja, um, the pastor in front of El Shaddai World Evangelism Ministries in Sacramento, California, and as well as in Africa, Liberia, Ghana, and other parts of Africa. Well, um, let me tell you a little bit about myself. Uh, I came from a very small country for the 3,000 square miles, uh, Liberia, West Africa. Um, Liberia went through a 14 year civil crisis that almost took up one third of the population. And I was homeless in my own country, a victim in my own country. Uh, my father died during the war. Uh, I had a brother who died during the war. Um, bullets and bombs, um, I mean, took us one day by surprise. And I mean, the country suffered war. I had to run for my, for my entire life. I had to run, stepping on dead bodies. Um, and God delivered me. Uh, during that time, r running, coming against the rebel forces, every time God spared my life when they did not kill me, this was my commitment to God. I said, God, if you spare my life, I will serve you the rest of my life. And God took me from Liberia, spared my life, and brought me into the United States of America, put me in ministry, and we've been serving the Lord. Um, the Lord had me to found El Shaddai World Evangelism Ministry. Um, the church has been founded for six years now, and we have been going all around the world preaching the gospel of the kingdom. And God has been doing great things in, in, in our life. Um, we we on television in Sacramento, and I mean, taking the nation by storm. One of the important things while in Liberia, uh, one of my greatest ministry was uh, deliverance and I dealt with demons and devils at a higher level and because of that uh, the law anointed me to deal with demons and witchcraft and uh, that was an area God uh, uh, showed me in, in Liberia because of that um, I began to show people how to pray because it was through prayer when God delivered us It was through the power of confessing prayer that I even got delivered from the war that I got delivered from uh, 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 Demonic forces that, that that wanted to attack me um, There were times, you know, I, I was left half dead, you know, but God spared my life It was through confessing the Word of God and when I came to the States, through years, years went back, and the Lord had give, given me a book called The Power of Confessing Prayers. I'll tell you, this is a powerful book. Um, and one, one, one of the things I began to place in this book, you know, the, the power consp uh, of confessing prayers is a spiritual warfare while the Navy SEAL and special forces are to the, med are to the military. Uh, this prayer will help you. There are times you have been praying and the enemy is not even moving. But I tell you, there are prayers in this book that will cause the enemy to move. It will cause the enemy to, to, to take a grip of your family, your life, your entire family. Now during the time of economic crisis, you need a prayer that can break forth and break through every obstacles in, in your life. There are some of you who when you wake up in the morning, you cannot even pray unto the Lord. You are rushing, you are going to work. Well, this book is perfect for you. We have a CD in this book. You can just put the CD in your uh, CD player in your vehicle and let this prayer pray and just allow this prayer to pray and you pray along with it and you will see the power of God, the hand of God in your life. I tell you, as you begin to confess this prayer, the Bible says life and death is in the power of the tongue. As you and I begin to confess the word of God, you will begin to see your environment changing. Life and death is in the yard of the tongue, the hand of the tongue. If, if I'm not satisfied with what's going on in, in, in my life, I use my hands to change my environment. I use my hands to change my room. If I'm not, if I'm not satisfied with how my room looks, so it is the power of confessing prayer. He said life and death is in the power of the tongue. Power means hand, in the hand of the tongue. Your hand can change any situation. How does a butterfly change? Uh, 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 how does a caterpillar change from being a, a caterpillar to a butterfly? Well, it's, it's simple. It's that stuff that comes from out of the mouth. When he spills that thing out of his mouth, he changes from a caterpillar into a butterfly. When you and I begin to speak the word of God out of our mouth, 
Hallelujah. We can see God moving in on our behalf. We can see life changing. We can see everything changing in our life just because we confess the word. I want to get this book to you. You can go on our website, elshadowworld.com, and you can purchase this book. It's a powerful book, and it will change your life. We have other books that will be available, the, the Purpose of the Church. A lot of people don't even know the purpose of the church. I have another book that is coming out called Dreams and Vision. You can order the books, and it will be a blessing in your life. God bless you. We are located in Sacramento, California. If you want to know our phone number, it's 916-736-6200. You call that phone number and someone will get in touch with you. If you desire prayer, we will pray with you. Because prayer is the key this season. Don't you know the devil is doing most of his work during the night time, during the night season? I'll show you how to tap into the, the deep things of God. And how you and I can come out victorious. How you and I can come out and, 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 and receive the victory that Jesus has given us this life. God bless you. I'm Apostle McDonald Ja. Thank you. We exposing thug mentality. Hey, yo, what's up, man? Did you get the book? The book? What book? Man, go to thugexposed.com and get the book, Thug Mentality Exposed, by author Rayford Johnson. Thug Exposed? Yeah, man. The book is deep and very informative of the occultic movement called thug mentality. Say what? Yeah. Man, for instance, uh -huh. did you know that sagging pants started in prison what? as male prostitution? Oh, man, let me pull my pants out. Mama, where my belt at? <laughs> you crazy. Hey, listen to this. The author's written facts is ancient spiritual history dating all the way back to ancient Babylon. Whoa, I gotta get that book, man. Man, what you say that was? Go to thugexposed.com uh -huh. or call 1-866-909-BOOK. Representing truth. Okay. So get with the new movement. Oh, for sure. At thugexposed.com. We exposing thug mentality.